In this video, I'm going to be showing you how I apply chemical relaxer to my natural 4C hair for the first time as a texturizer. So I'm going to be using olive oil chemical relaxer and then I'm going to follow up with a hair restore hair mayonnaise but I'm going to use fenugreek powder as well just to really add some extra oomph to this mask. Then I will use African Pride olive oil hair moisturizing lotion. So that is what I'm going to use. So let's have a look inside the box. We've got, you know, the shampoo, conditioner, oil boost, leave-in conditioner, activator, the cream, and I'm going to be adding olive oil to all of this. So I just put the cream activator in a tub, add the liquid activator, and then I'm going to absolutely douse it with olive oil. I saw another YouTuber do this and I thought, what a great idea. Turns out that there's actually oil boost in the box for this exact reason. So I didn't actually need to add the oil, but anyway, so I just mix it all in. It's going to really add moisture to my hair instead of drying it out. So here I am. First of all, guys and girls, you need to add petroleum jelly to your edges. If you want to keep your edges, you better protect those edges. So I'm just going to put it around my hairline, around my ears, the tops of my ears, around the back of my nape, work that in, and then section my hair into four sections. Ta-da! I'm going to add the relaxer to my roots. You don't want to dilly-dally here. You want to make sure that you speed through this process because you don't want the relaxer on your roots for too long. So just work it around your hair as fast as you possibly can and get through it. So the reason I'm relaxing my hair is because I just want it to just be a looser curl. I don't want to have straight hair, so I don't leave this relaxer on for the recommended time. Here you can see me smoothing it through. This just helps stretch and lengthen the hair. So for me, I really wanted the roots to be that little bit more stretched but the rest of the hair, I still wanted to see my kinks, but obviously not to the extent of being 4C. So that's why I'm doing this. And I quite enjoyed the process. So as you can see, it's all loose and floppy. I was so happy with the results. So I'm going to go ahead now, wash it out, and then I'm going to make the mask. So in the packet is the conditioner. I'm just going to add that in a cup along with the hair mayonnaise. I thought I might as well just combine these two conditioners, you know. So that's why I did that. And then I'm going to put the fenugreek powder. So if you've watched any of my other videos, you know I love to use Ayurvedic herbs and spices and fenugreek is one of them it's high in protein and nicotinic acid it prevents against hair fall it also helps with scalp issues like dryness balding thinning and dandruff so it's a really good powder so that's why I had to add that so I'm just going to work that into my hair into my roots I'm going to leave it on for a while before washing it out As you can see, I'm just detangling here. I've still got some curls here, you know. As you can see, I've not I've not completely lost all of my curls. It's just looser. So I've washed it all out. It definitely has a different texture than it did before. It does feel drier, so I'm just going to reintroduce oils into my hair using this African Pride olive oil hair moisturizer. I'm gonna do a follow-up video of how I feel about putting chemicals on my hair when I'd been natural for so long. 
So if you'd like to see that, please stay tuned. Please like this video, comment and subscribe if you haven't already. See you in the next video.